Most people believe the number one factor in the way you age is genetics. You might think, oh, well, some people just really hit the lucky jackpot with genes and that's why they look and feel great when they get older. The rest of us just aren't so lucky. In reality, the number one factor in the way you age is not genetics. The number one factor in the way you age is how you think about aging. A couple of years ago, a friend walked over to our piano and said, oh, I've always wanted to learn to play piano, but now it's just too late. How old do you think my friend is? He is 31. <laughs> He's 31 and his brain and his hands and his eyes work great. And yet he believes he is too old. Our culture is so damn negative about aging that many people, even at 31, believe their possibilities are shrinking. Now, that might seem ridiculous to you, but be honest. Have you ever thought of a dream or an experience or something you wanted to do, some desire that was coming up in you and you thought, oh, I'm just too old. I should have done it earlier. It's too late. Negative beliefs are so prevalent in our culture that almost all of us take them on without even realizing it. The good news is at any age, you can expand into greater possibilities, health, vitality, and impact. I'm Leah Bales, and I'd love to help you with that. A great first step is to tune in to my We Are More Than Our Age podcast series on my Soul Big Life show podcast. We begin September 1st because September is Healthy Aging Month, and you'll enjoy on the podcast wonderful conversations with dynamic creative people in the second half of life, as well as focused mini masterclasses to give you the skills and confidence and mind-busting changes <laughs> to create the life you love at every age. So join us for the We Are More Than Our Age podcast series on the Soul Big Life Show beginning September 1st and make every age your best age.